Okay, I think... I think the plans for today are are ready to go. I, I should be able to do today's epi way better than we did yesterday's epi. So, what's up, buddies? Welcome to another episode of The Rich Man Road to Glory, episode number eight, day two of our team of the year pack hunt. So, yesterday's video went off a treat. Thank you guys so much for the support. I appreciate that. Um, I think these videos, instead of the scheduled like 8 a.m. UK time that I'm uploading them the next day, essentially, I actually think I'm just going to upload these videos the the second I have them done and rendered and then uh Anthony my graphics guy has the thumbnail ready to go so you guys today might actually get this video within a couple of hours of me actually having done recording it so you technically could be getting two videos in one day but I think that should be a little bit better so I'm excited for today's episode EA have confirmed I believe via Twitter that we'll be getting midfielders today as well which should be fantastic We've got De Bruyne, Conte, and Modric in there. Thinking a 99 rated Luka Modric is what we're going to get. So the challenge for today and today's epi or today's video is going to be the same as yesterday. I promise you guys a giveaway every single day for Team of the Year that we do this RTG series or this FIFA point pack opening RTG for uh, the Team of the Year. So we're going to do the same challenge we did yesterday. Yesterday's video, we ended on... Uh, I guess goal or achievement number three. So today's video is going to be the same thing. Uh, if I get an 85 or less rated player, it'll be a $50 giveaway to the YouTube subscribers. All right. All you got to do is like the video and put, oh my God, De Bruyne is sexier than Nick. Ha <laughs> ha. Good luck remembering that. Um, okay. So yesterday we got all the way to $150 giveaway. We got an informed walkout in Rashford. Can we do better today? With the lightning rounds and all the things going on, I'm hoping we can do a little bit better today. But that is going to be the goal. So you just got to like the video and, oh my God, uh, De Bruyne is sexier than Nick. That's it. All right? That's all you got to do for today's video to be part of the giveaways. And Twitch chat, same challenge goes for you guys, except I'll also be gifting subs. And uh, you really don't have to do anything, Twitch. You guys just get to be part of the giveaways as long as you are a subscriber to the channel. So I've reformatted the team a little bit. Just because I'm, uh, I'm I'm kind of excited at the prospect of Conte and De Bruyne. Now, I don't know for this rich man team if this squad is even going to be remotely achievable, right? I just, don't, I just don't know if we'll be able to ever get there. But we could, right? It just depends on where the prices are at. Now, I screwed up a little bit with Leo Messi. I think I should have picked him up yesterday. He, his price got down to 4.9 uh, by now yesterday and i still didn't pick him up because i think this coming weekend the prices could be low previous years the prices dropped pretty decently uh around the saturday and the sunday specifically so i'm gonna wait to pick up a leo messi until the weekend and the good news is all the other players we're looking at right now for this account for this rich man account which again once we build the team then we're gonna actually try and do weekend league on this account and see how i do with like a god squad by May, I would assume, May or June, maybe by team of the season, we could actually have this team done and ready to go to challenge uh, butt champs or hell champs, if you will. But I, I, I think this is going to be a proper setup. That team of the year, Van Dyke, is really, really exciting. The only thing I might change, depending on where um, where the values are and, and, and whether or not the, the card is good, is maybe this. I might still stick to Vieira and... Sadorf. So with the way this team will be set up, we'll have Clarence Sadorf as a DM, left DM, that pushes up the field. Patrick Vieira as the holding DM. We'll have Team of the Year De Bruyne as our central cam. We'll have Team of the Year Messi as our right cam. We'll have uh, Neymar Zito as our left cam. And then we'll have Johan Cruyff, prime card, as our striker at the top of the pitch. And then the back line stays exactly the same. So that's what I'm thinking what we could do. Maybe with a little bit of variance, depending if I want to go with Conte instead of uh instead of Viera. so that's the first thing the second thing i wanted to do today i think the process is going to be good so we're going to rip through packs we've got one minute until the team of the year players are out so we're going to rip packs and look at the players and then i think you guys did enjoy me trying to get the player a, a, a team of the year player in the draft so we're going to continue trying to do that I won a draft yesterday on the poor man road to glory as well. Later on in the evening, we ran a draft. I tried to get Ronaldo or Messi or, or Mbappe. It didn't happen either. But we're on five straight draft wins on the poor man road to glory right now. So we're doing very, very good in terms of performances. So we'll see today if we can get ourselves a team of the year and then test out the team of the year player in game. So 
we've got what 30 seconds or so before things start so do i look at the players first or do we do we dabble a little bit with the lightning round what do we do do we dabble do we dabble or do we look at the players first mm, what do we do what do we do what do we do should we should we dabble should we dabble 65k 55k 25k no way hold on a second hold on okay you know what man it's fine 50k packs are fine did they release him let's see boys let's go look at that debrina yo did they release sbcs as well oh my god dude if they release the sbcs hold on 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 everybody everybody just shut up everybody just shut up and relax okay so we got debrina what's he looking like oh 97 to look at the shooting upgrade oh my god what even is that card dude what even is that card i don't know why why i would have thought dude oh my god oh my god bro what is that what is that what is that card dude what do you even give him you don't need to worry about his shooting anymore you still want to work on the agility and the balance and i mean his passing is pretty damn pretty much incredible as a central cam what the hell do you get do you just give him an anchor for the sake of it like i don't you could give him an engine but that's a bit of a waste oh my god bro what a freaking card that is okay so how does somebody pack this card already dude how how that just goes to show you how many people are opening packs right now okay so De Bruyne has already been packed ggs guarantee you that sells honestly um probably to a youtuber or something like that okay let's go look at kante how much is well not even how much is kante but what's Ka kante's card based off of that De Bruyne, kante's got to be insane man come on 96 rated Conte. Okay, I actually thought they'd give him a little bit of a higher rating. Dude, look at that dynamic image. 90 pace. What is that card? Dude, there's... Okay. I think we're going to have to do that. I think we're going to have to do that. What is that card, man? And someone's packed him? What? What? I don't even understand what that is. What is that? What is that, dude? What a card, man. 96 Conte, 97 uh, De Bruyne, biggest joke, lol. I mean, if you're getting upset because De Bruyne has one more rating than Conte, I guess you're leading a pretty good life then. That's, you know, if that's the biggest of your concerns, then GG's. My God, again, I don't know. I guess you get, you don't even need to. These cards don't need chem styles. Genuinely, these cards don't need chem styles. They just, just keep them all on basic and you're good to go, man. Look at his shooting stats as well for a DM, man. That's madness. 90, oh my God. To think that in champs and division two, this is probably all the type of things that you're going to face, man. Team of the years and prime icons galore. Wow, okay, let's go. Did they give Luka Modric the 99 that he deserves? Did they give it to him? Come on, EA. Come on, EA. Don't fuck this up. Let's go. Good stuff, EA. What is that card? <laughs> oh, my God. What is that card? Is that the first ever card to get 99 everything? Is that the first ever card to get what? That's got to be. You know how Hullet Gang used to be 80 rated? What? What? Is that the first card ever to get 90 club? That's the Modric. The Modric men? I don't know. You'd have to come up with a name now for Luka Modric, dude. Bro, what? Oh, Raja Nangolin did get it one year, right? Did 94 Raja. Yeah, never mind. Okay, forget it. Forget what I said there. Forget what I said there, dudes. Um, What is that card, though? Dude what is that card four star four star high high 99 agility 99 balance you know what man this could be the best card the best cam card that anyone's ever used in fifa legitimately man 
if you give him a hawk as well his strength goes to like 82 sprint speed goes to 90 acceleration to 99 all of his shooting goes to 99 holy god man wow 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 i have no way of fitting this card in the club man i have no i have no way of fitting him in the club zero zero chance will still feel like a bronze in bad gameplay yeah i i mean you know yeah you really only want to use these cards in good gameplay so basically this week you don't want to be playing any damn fifa the servers are so horrendous man the draft we played yesterday was so bad wow 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 i mean i could very easily fit Modric in the setup as well there's no there's no way i could do i mean this team already is near unaffordable i i took 99 ronaldo out of the team and i still think this by by march i won't be able to even afford this team man anyways that's the goal it is a dream team right so dreams are meant to be chased um now let's have a quick look here at sbcs before we start ripping packs okay so a new team of the year challenge set this one's bronze again is that is that accurate come on yay uh, dude, we made a hundred thousand coins yesterday. No, that's unfortunate. We made a hundred and something thousand coins yesterday off of selling bronze players out of the poor man road to glory club. So unfortunately, this one you can't use bronze players. 79 rated squad. Alright, for a prime electrum pack. I'm gonna go do it on the RTG again. And then what's this one? What is this one? Premium gold player pack. Exactly gold again, Bundesliga. Okay, so boring as hell from EA, but two more packs on the poor man road to glory, so that works out. Uh, okay, so Premier League upgrades with three Premier League players. So this is... Okay, so this is very similar to what they did a week or two ago. In fact, it's exactly the same. Is it the same requirements? Ooh, do we go on the poor man road to glory and start like building up these packs on the poor man rtg what do you guys think do we start building these packs up on the poor man rtg because these are going to be about eight thousand coins a pop right something like that about 8k a pop i mean dudes i opened like 150 of these during the rttf promo I opened like 60, 70, or 80 premium uh, Premier League packs, the player packs, and we opened about 60 or 70, 80 of the La Liga packs as well. And we got nothing. <laughs> nothing. The best packs I got were from 7.5k League Air packs, man. Oh my god, I don't... Dude, there's too, too many choices. What do you chase? What do you chase? Do I chase a Cristiano Ronaldo? Do we go for the ultimate? I don't know. Okay, so and apparently they dropped another icon as well. Who do they drop? Is it... Now, I see people saying best. George Best? Or is it... Oh, it is George Best! I felt like it was the best icon available. Okay. First of all, how much is the loan? 84 rated 84 rated for a 93 best i'm actually surprised by that only 84 i thought it would have been 85 minimum so he's as expensive to do as a stoikov dude that card is insane dude that card is insane what what is his four star four star oh my god bro four star four star Okay, how many icons do you guys think? Okay, one. Is it just one icon for George Best? No. Dude, I actually think icon prices are going to start coming down even more. It's only one. Wow. <laughs> Cringy round of applause for EA Sports. One icon required for George Best. I might have to rinse Gianfranco Zola for this. I might have to rinse Gianfranco Zola for this, dudes. What do you guys think? He would go right into position where Gianfranco Zola is. He'd be my left cam. Oh. And if I restructure the team a little bit, 
I actually think I could benefit even more. Because I believe I'll be able to get Ben uh, Ben Yetter on chem too. Okay. It might be worth trying out his loan first on the on the road to glory. 84. So he's gonna be about 30 to 40k to do. About 30k to do on um uh on PlayStation at least. I think that could be worth it. Maybe we do a squad builder around best, like a dream team squad builder around best and really see if he's worth it. Huh. Interesting, man. I like George Best too. Like that's year on year. George Best always has had a pretty damn good card. Last year we missed out on George Best, didn't we? All right. Well, let's get into the pack session here. Um, shh. You know what? I'm an idiot. Oh, they're still available. Oh, lightning rounds. Wow. 10 minutes in and they haven't even expired. Ooh, okay. All right, should we do some? Let's do the lightning. I mean, we might get through 24,000 FIFA points right here, bros. Okay, so the pack challenge is on. No walkout, but if it's 85 rated or less, let's go. So I owe you guys on YouTube right now a $50 PayPal giveaway. All you got to do is like the video and then as a comment, put, oh my God, Debrina is sexier than Nick 28T. That's it. So already... We're up to the first achievement, of course, right? Like, there's, there's no surprises there that we're up to the first achievement. Um, oh my god, that's discard! Bro, what? Okay. Straight up discard, man. Straight up discard. I kind of like 50Ks, man. I think 50Ks is where I packed Team of the Year Ronaldo in FIFA 17, right? I believe. Wrong Croatian, unfortunately. Wrong Croatian board. Uh, bro, oh my god. This is just straight. It's just gonna be... Oh, you know what? Oh! I'm gonna cringe you guys out. You know what we could do? Should we do... Uh, I'm just gonna discard this guy. Shh. Dudes, should we go do... Uh, on the epi, I don't know if this is gonna bore you guys, but should we grind as well... The league packs on on this account? Why not? We need De Bruyne. We need Messi. We need Kante, and we need Van Dyke. Yo, should this is a thought? This is a thought thought for this series. Why not? While we're spending money on FIFA points, when only certain players are in packs, I rinse my players to get Premier League and La Liga player packs, and we save them all until all the players are in packs that is an idea dudes so we rip i mean either either way each episode i'm gonna rip a minimum of um a minimum of twenty four thousand fifa points and then for one final big pack opening on the rich man rtg we sit there and i i would assume open at least 40 or 50 or 60 player packs that could be fun, man. That'll be so long. Oh fuck no, dude. Are you kidding me? I'll, I'll rip. I'll rip through those packs. Uh, I'll rip through those packs. And I mean, I, I I could do them here too, but, um, dude, yeah, I love that idea, man. I love that idea. Do it on the PMRTG. Oh, trust me, I'm gonna be doing this on the PMRTG for sure, my dude, for sure. All right. So so far, no walkout. No walkout in form. So we're still on a $50 giveaway. That's it. God damn. Pack weight is so awful, dude. Pack weight is so, so, so bad. Oh, Tevez. Not even his flashback card. Thanks a lot, EA. Son's crying. What are we talking about doing? Taking all of the rare players I have on this account and rinsing them through. Oh, okay. There it is. Please be blue. Ah, it's not blue. Okay. So it's a walkout. So we're up to the next stage of the giveaway right now, dudes. Can it be a good Juventus CV or is it going to be a pleb? All right, it's Bonucci. So I now owe you guys $100 via PayPal and Twitch viewers as well. I owe you guys a $100 PayPal giveaway for the subs. And at the end of this recording, 20 gifted subs for the non-subs in the chat. All right, so we've gone up one stage. That's good. At least we can, at least we got to walk out Bonucci, man. <clears throat> Uh, the hope of it being blue is too much for me. I know, me too, man. 
Me too. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a nerd when it comes to that stuff. Look at these prices, man. If you are considering doing Icon SBCs, like, this has got to be the week to do them, right? Just basically every player value is nothing right now. Every player value is absolutely nothing. You think it's worth doing best on a regular PMRTG? No, I don't think it's worth ever doing any Icon SBCs on any regular RTG. Just buy them off the market. Stay liquid. Don't rinse your coins, man, for nothing. Unless you eventually... Okay, we got an inform. Is that a walkout? No, 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 no. It's uh, the B-Tech Kyle Walker. I'd have a cardiac arrest if I got a blue. Me and you both, brother. Okay, we'll go until we... Well, maybe not until I fill up the trade file, but we'll we'll go we'll go for a good go for a good session here. Go for a good session here. Oh, I like that idea though, man. Alright, well, can skip that. Uh I'm gonna live an investor's dream. You should. You should. Absolutely, man. Absolutely. I, I, I wouldn't be spending money Thanks at all. For the sub! Oh my god, my ears. It's your boy. Thank you for the 48. Appreciate you, dude. God bless, man. All right. There you go. Profit on profit, right, guys? <laughs> oh, God. Hate spending money on this. Hey, game. Batch. Mike, thank you, man. Appreciate the 500 bits. No message either. Just straight up 500 bits. Thank you, sir. He's a kid with the corner. Considering I can do Keen with many untradeables in my club, I'm gonna do them. Hey, go for it, man. Go for it. Yeah, I mean, you do what you want. I'm, I'm just, I'm just here to, to try and help out a little bit, right? I think, I think as you have untradeables in your club, um, you know, you can definitely work towards one of the icons. But my, my thoughts, man, is for the most part on a regular RTG is not to go with the untradeables, man. Go, with the, go with the tradables every time, man. Every single time, go with the untradeables. Oh, sorry, go with the tradables. As much as possible, you want to minimize the untradeables you have in your club on a regular road to glory. And then people will say, Amen. oh, that's super boring. To me, it's the opposite of boring. It means you can constantly build any team that you want. Holy moly. Uh, Leon, Skittles, Sportsman, uh, Pro Twist, Amen. Patman, uh, Jake, Obi. And JKA, thank you guys all for the new subs, the Prime subs. You guys are all part of the $100 PayPal giveaway and the $20 uh, gifted subset at the end uh, of this epi recording. Get rid of that, pleb. Are 84s, uh, are, are 84s worthless nowadays, chat, as well? All right. I always find it worth if I have 50% of my players untradeable. See, the thing is, though, man, is 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 the, the best play is to not have players untradeable, right? So, like, for the uh, division rivals, I, I always recommend you go with the tradable packs, man, if you're running a regular RTG. Best way to go, man. Best way to go. League upgrade packs are out. Yeah, we, we already checked them out. Spinks, thank you for the four, man. Appreciate you. Okay. All right, bros. I think we, I think we go, I think we go rinse, man. I think we go rinse. Oh, yo, I got an idea. I got an idea. I got to think this through here real quick. I got to think this through. So do we just give up on the Serie A in general? I think what could be a good play here is we go premium prem for all the players that we want. And premium La Liga because, again, I want a team of the year Messi on this account, right? So that'll be the most efficient thing. And then, with the non-rares that we've already rinsed through the club. So we don't actually have any non-rares anymore because I did a, I did a 20, what was it? 30 gold upgrade pack opening uh, after we did the recording yesterday on the Richman account. And it was, it was great. We got informs, one or two walkouts as well. So gold upgrade packs are always good, man. I'm going to remove marquee matchups as well. Don't really care about them. So I guess then the question remains, how many, do we just do as many as possible? Wait, is this a La Liga premium? Okay. 
So you set this up, dudes. For those of you guys that want the most efficient way to rinse, this is the most efficient way to rinse. Work your way, work your way backwards, and just do boom, boom, boom. Get rid of everything, man. I mean, you can even get rid of 83s, genuinely. At this point, 83s are discard. Unless you're, you know, you're 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 you want to hold on to them for when they inevitably go up because of the one to watch promos. Usual, thank you to the 16, man. Appreciate you. In before DEA don't release the full team of the year? No, they they, they will do. Wait, hold on. What, which one was this one that I just clicked? PL. All right. I'm going to do one full rinsing of the PL. Oh, look at that. They change it up with a 4-2-3-1, huh? Okay. Upgrade packs out for five days. EA keep the market up is a good idea. Oh, for sure, right? This the, Basically, with all the lightning rounds that are going on right now, um, these upgrade packs will keep even the shitty golds at a decent price and will keep ever like will keep the market from being flooded that's the other thing these upgrade packs inevitably will just have people rinsing their golds endlessly for the hopes of getting something good so it's yeah it's a very very intelligent play from ea first sbc was la liga i know it's weird hey and then it like it just switched it doesn't really matter it's not that deep should you leave uh, as well uh, if Neymar wins on Friday, yeah, on Friday. I mean, dudes, we're gonna be spending so much money on this account, like you know, over the next week. Again, twenty-four thousand people points every single day when uh, the midfielders, forwards, whatever are out, and then it might go up from there, right? If you guys are enjoying this, I mean, I hate spending money on this game, genuinely, I do. But for content, if you guys are enjoying this and you and you want to see this on stream and YouTube, you guys want to see that, um, then I, then I'll keep it going at least for Team of the Year, right? I don't like doing this, but if it, if it helps you guys not spend money because you see how fucking bad pack weight is, and at least maybe you can live vicariously through my stupidity, and it stops you from spending money on the game, then sure, I'll do it. You know, it is what it is. I can't believe that Modric is... It, dude, that Modric is better than a pro player card. I honestly think that Team of the Year Modric is better than the t a, a Modric that EA would give to Modric. You know, like a pro player Luka Modric? I bet you that Team of the Year card is better. Crazy, man fantastic good on ea man i love that they're going all out this is one of the best things that they could do team of the year should always have the absolute best versions of the players there's no moderate that for the rest of this year should be released better in my opinion at least in my in my most humblest of opinions that's even possible for me to be humble at this point man i just want i just want blues my club still hasn't restocked the players since the last pl packs oh damn you know what me neither bro I spent money, dude. I, I we spent. I ended up only spending 200k actual coins on the poor man road to glory, but we calculated the value on the poor man road to glory of the packs I opened, and I spent 800,000 coins on packs on the poor man RTG, and we literally got nothing. I mean, I guess we did get an inform 86 Lala and a couple of walkouts and stuff like that, but overall, overall, not great, man. Not a great, not a great return at all. Not, not only did I gut my club, dude, I, I bought endless amounts of players. Endless amounts of players. I think I single-handedly rinsed the entire PlayStation market of rare golds. Gameplay is gross today? Well, it's just because of how many people are on the game, right? Does, does, does not surprise me that gameplay is horrifying, though. I believe you. I believe you. Wait till this weekend. How are we meant to play Weekend League, man? How are we meant to be, play Weekend League with... Uh, with with the full team in packs, all the promos EA are going to do, and everybody also jumping onto the servers to play their weekend league games. It's going to be, un it potentially could be unplayable, man. I think we're going to just try and grind our way to gold three again and be done with it. Right? For for, th for this month, uh, until I'm back from vacation, I think we're just going to grind gold three. Grind gold three, build up the club, trade um bronze pack method like crazy now especially because we finished every single league the poor man road to glory is just printing coins uh we did i opened like eight silver packs or nine silver packs on the web app on the poor man road to glory earlier today and and we made like 40 50 000 coins profit because i was able to sell every single player no more storing anything squad fitnesses are 400 no dude that is uh that is a good shout man See, that's the only unfortunate thing with me doing this series right now instead of just mm, still grinding on the poor man road to glory. Deep. If I was on the poor man road to glory right now, I'd just be picking up squad fitnesses. I'd just be picking up squad fitnesses. No matter what, in a month or in a couple of weeks, they'll all go back up to 1,000 or more or 1,400. 
Trey, thank you for the four. Sold my team yesterday. Made an untradeable squad that will get me gold three for the weekend league for the rest of the year. Upset I poured so much money into the game, but it was a first year full lesson, so lesson learned. Going to get ready for MLB 19 now. Oh, God. Uh, LJ, thank you for the four as well. Usual. Sphinx, thank you guys. Appreciate you, dudes. They might be lower on Friday when the full team is live. Potentially, dude. Potentially, right? You got to remember that in previous years, though, when everybody was waiting for that Messi and Ronaldo, last year, I was one of them. I waited too long for Messi and Ronaldo, and their prices just boomed. Like, a day after the team of the year, the prices just started to boom. So, it's really hard to get the timing right, man. About 45k's worth of squad fitnesses uh, for eight, 900 coins each. Eat, sleep, soccer, Andy, they're like 400 coins now. 500 coins now. But I think even even for eight nine hundred coins, you're all right, dude. You're gonna just have to wait a hell of a lot longer to make your money back. But you'll be all right. There we go. Yeah. So up to eighty threes. I'm just getting rid of man. They're all discard anyways. They're eight hundred. To be fair, to be honest. Well, why are you guys lying to me then? I was lazy to wait to open the SBC packs. I didn't even, didn't even get a board. How many packs did you open? So you went through all of your saved packs on your road to glory for three midfielders? Bro, come on, man. You need to have that composure. You need to have that ability to wait, bro. You need to. Come on, man. Have that self-control, dude. Do not open your packs until they're all in packs. I mean, either way, none of us are going to get anything anyways. Saturday and Sunday, we're all going to be sitting there opening packs for Team of the Year. And absolutely effing none of us are gonna get anything but you know all of pain patience is a virtue yeah i mean you'd want it to be you'd want it to be last two years the cheapest time to buy is saturday and sunday when full team of the year is out every team of the year was cheapest those days won't change this year yeah i agree i agree i remember in feast for 17 though the, the the team of the year prices plummeted the day or two after uh they were in they were in uh they were in packs, like when when they left packs. So for FIFA 18, I waited on the Poor Man Road to Glory I because I wanted to get Messi's Team of the Year card last year on the Poor Man Road to Glory. So I waited the day after and the day after that, and his price fucking skyrocketed. So I ended up overspending on him. So I think for this year, yeah, Saturday, Sunday is when you'd want to try and pick them up. So far, Messi's cheapest was 4.9. So far, Ronaldo's cheapest was 7.7. .7. That's the cheapest they've been that I've seen. Uh, and now they're obviously going to just keep going up and up and up because they're not in packs anymore until the week. And you sold his ass. I did sell him, yeah. I did. I did sell that team of the year, Messi. You are right. Oh, wait. I don't think that counts, right? Shit. Oh, that does not count. Awkward? I don't know why I thought that would be a rare, dude. What a, what a, what a pleb. I need to grind for rank one this week. Ew, what, on rivals? Nah, man. Now that I'm in D2, I, I think I'm chill. I think I'm chill. I don't know if I'm going to worry too much about uh, about grinding like crazy. I'm going to get that Quincy Promise. That's the foot swap card that I want for sure. He goes into the Dutch team on the RTG, on the poor man RTG. And then from there, I'll either like pick a pack or pick maybe the other two foot swap, the 84 rated foot swaps that are three a piece. Why is Messi always less than Ronaldo? It's just Ronaldo's more meta and you have all the sweat lords of FIFA wanting to abuse Ronaldo, right? Leo Messi to me is, is, is a more fun attacker to use than Cristiano. I think he's more silky. Every year, Leo Messi's more silky. But you, there's no denying that Cristiano Ronaldo's the better FIFA card. He just, he just fits the meta, man. He fits the meta. Luce, thank you for the two. Lou Farin, thank you for the nine. Appreciate you, sir. See, just this little grind session, man, I'd love to see how much we actually have. Watch me pack a team of the year on this account and not on the poor man road to glory, dude. I'm not going to lie. I'd be a little bit salty, man. Be a little bit salty. Yeah, I think Prem and La Liga is the best route to go, though, for these upgrades. Just, to, just opening Serie A packs for a chance at just Cristiano Ronaldo, I don't know if it's the best play. Could be wrong. Give me that Messi all day. Uh, his inform is the best card I've used. Dude, every time I have... I mean, also every time I have Ronaldo, I tend to win the draft as well. But specifically, every time I have uh, Leo Messi in the draft, 
I ball out, man. Heart is so, so strong. So, so strong. Uh, NB, thank you for the four. I'm back. Even if I'm not playing FIFA anymore, I still love to watch you. Yo, well, thank you, man. I appreciate that you love to, to watch, and I'm heartbroken that uh, you've given up on the game, man. It's too bad. It's too bad. And that's uh, that's all EA's fault, man. That's not your fault. That's that's straight up EA. They've just dropped the ball big this year, man. They've dropped the ball big this year on server. The lack of server stability, the lack of of communication with their viewer base. Even though we've been promised a lot of communication. Uh, the lack of proper updates that address major server issues, the lack of proper good content. We've, we've had like flashback cards, fantastic. The way they fixed Icon SBCs, fantastic. Um, the two weeks where we got the, the, the Joseph Martinez and the Santi Cathorla in weekly objectives with fun achievements, fantastic. The problem is those are such minute moments of good content filled with so much dog shit content and so much money whoring money hungry content team of the year is just for ea to make big profits that nobody's denying that right and that's disappointing man and that's why so many people in the start of january or even mid-december have given up on this game because ea just make it so blatantly obvious what they care about and that's just just people that spend money on the game that's it that's it you know so I don't blame you guys for giving up on the game. I love FIFA. I love Ultimate Team. I love football. I love the Poor Man Road to Glory series. I love the Rich Man Road to Glory series. And I'm a content creator on Twitch and YouTube. So I'm always going to play FIFA 19 no matter how dog shit it is. It's part of my business. It's part of my job. So I'm not going to give up on it. I can just hope to God that they pull their head out and start actually making the game better. And, and working on good content, man. You know, uh, the, the fact that they've given these upgrade packs, I guess that's a step in the right direction, right? Definitely a step in the right direction. But I still think they could have done so much, man. So much. With weekly objectives, with, with, with just... Oh, man. I didn't even want to get into it because I could go off on a big rant and I don't want to. For people who don't spend money on the game, Team of the Year is dead. Well, see, I agree, but kind of disagree. At least now, for people that don't spend money on the game, you can spend uh, seven to 8,000 coins a pack on doing these uh, player packs, league-specific player packs. So that's kind of fun. That gives you a better chance of packing a Team of the Year card. Still next to zero chance of actually getting one, but still gives you a chance to get something. <clears throat> do, 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 do. The one thing I hate the most about opening packs on console, though, is that you can only see 30. I think that's so idiotic from EA. That you're you're stuck only being able to see 30 and you have to go on the web app or the companion app. Like, on your my cell phone, I can see all the packs. On my PC, I can see all the packs. But on console, I can't see all the packs. How stupid is that, man? Like, it's just so idiotic. I opened 40 premium... Prem packs, not even a walkout. What? Not even a walkout? Dude, you sure you didn't open the 7.5k packs? I'm, I'm getting rid of all of this, dude. Don't care, don't care, don't care. They're not worth anything anyways. Alright, there we go. One league left, bros. Nick, do premium packs. Please tell me I'm doing premium packs. Dude, don't scare me like that, bro. I thought for a second I was rinsing. Rinsing all my rares through 7.5k packs. You freaked me out. From my own experience, 7.5k packs are better. Mine too. Mine too. Mine too. The only good players I got were from League and 7.5k packs. I got an Ederson. I could use Ederson, you know, instead of De Gea. That's another, another player we could toss into the Dream Team. Until I can afford a Team of the Year De Gea. I opened one and got David Silva. Hey, better than nothing, I suppose. Better than nothing. Opened 30 premium PL player packs, got Digne. How many coins should I expect from 72k FIFA points? Uh, on average, if you have dog shit pack luck, which 99% of the FIFA community has... On average, 12,000 FIFA points gives you 100,000 coins. 
That's pretty, and that's if you sell everything, okay? So that is if you sell squad fitnesses, if you sell the random anchors that you get, if you sell the random 84 or 85 hey, rated players that you get, on average, if you sell everything, you clear um, uh, you clear about 100,000 coins per 12,000 people points. I, trust me, I, I've, I've tested it over and over this year. That's exactly where it's at. That is exactly where it's at. And how much of a fucking ripoff is that, dude? $100, 100 pounds or 80 pounds or 130 Canadian dollars, depending on where you live. Let's say $100 to get 100,000 FIFA points, dude. And EA wonder why coin selling is so rampant this year. Not just because they don't fucking do anything about it and they're idiots and let people buy and sell coins left and right. But more importantly, because FIFA points are such a goddamn ripoff. They're so... They're just, it's just robbery. That's all it is. George Best means a lot to me, but I don't know whether to do his SBC. Um, hey man, you know what? My recommendation is you always stay liquid. Go buy them off the market. But if you're someone that got caught up in taking untradeable rewards from division rivals and you've got a crap ton of untradeable players in your club, then why not, why not go do them? Use all of your untradeable players for him, and then if you love George Best, do him, man. I mean, that, that's that got to be an endgame meta card, man. I I haven't used him, but look, based off of his stats, 4-star, four 4-star, four it's got to be an endgame meta card. Am I wrong? Please tell me I'm not wrong. Okay, so let's get back to these packs, man. Um, Am I going to... So we've got 27 of these ready to go for when they're uh, fully available. Oh, man! And what I'm going to do most likely on the Rich Man account, dudes... I know it's going to be a huge waste of coins and I should be efficient with this. But on the Rich Man account, when we do this pack opening, which could have 50 or 60 or 70 player packs, I'm just going to discard. Like, I'm going to open a pack, discard the contents. Open a pack, discard the contents. We're just going to have like one final big hurrah pack opening of, of these special packs to see if we can get a blue in them, all right? I'm not going to sit there and, um, and take forever. Now, with what we have left with our FIFA points... What do you guys think is the best? We've only gotten a walkout, man. So I only owe you guys a $100 giveaway for this video and $100 uh, to the subs in the chat. That's it, man. It's hard to think that yesterday we had better pack luck. So what would you guys think is the best best way to do this? Save the FIFA points for the lightning rounds in like 20 minutes? Or what do you guys think? Open a few of these. That's what, 3,500 FIFA points. Wait for wait for the 100Ks. So drafts until, until the next 100Ks come. Twenty five K packs are awful. I mean that. Well, that's what we have over here, right? I'm gonna open one just because I'm curious. I'm curious to see how god awful these are. I've got probably like 40 of these on the poor man RTG. And it's a board, but I love 25Ks. Not horrible, I guess. Uh, confirm items. Or do these and Uno Mass more FIFA points? Dude, ew, I'm not gonna do more. 24,000 FIFA points is crazy good, man. 24,000 FIFA points is crazy good. Okay, I'll tell you what. I'll make a deal. I did say I only wanted to spend 24,000 FIFA points in episode recording. I'll tell you what. If I pack, if we up the stage, okay? So right now, this is where we're at in terms of the giveaway for today on stream and the double giveaway for YouTube. This is where we're at. All right? Right here. $100 is what I owe you guys for the video. If me opening these 25k packs if i get the next stage so an inform walkout uh, it could be an 84 rated inform if i get an inform walkout i will add another 12,000 people points for the next lightning round deal if i don't get an inform walkout then i'm not doing it ea can fuck themselves sorry for being that blunt but if ea give me a bit of luck which then gives back to you guys so then it'll be 150 dollars paypal again uh 150 dollars paypal giveaway again then I'll do it. All right? So it's up to EA with the rest of these FIFA points. If we end these FIFA points and the only thing I've gotten is one walkout player, that's it. I'm done, man. And we'll try again tomorrow. EA can piss off.
Because I, I, I know that I tell you guys not to spend money in this game and not to get caught up in the gambling addiction. But opening packs is absolutely an addiction. And I don't want to tell you guys one thing, but then show you guys something else where I'm also showing the addiction. Done 24,000 people points? No, let me add more. Like, that's a terrible, terrible example to give my viewer base, man. So, there you go. I mean, I still am doing it, kind of. Ooh, Aryan Robin, not bad. I still am doing that, but at least I'm doing it like I'm challenging EA to something as well. All right, 9K, like 11. Go. Mo Bamba! I'm assuming it's worthless, right? Yeah, I'm just going to straight up, straight up discard him. Straight up discard him. Yeah, it's not a bad pack. I don't mind that at all, actually. Robin and an inform? That's decent from a 25K, man. You basically get five rares from the 350, basically the same cost as a 100k pack. Overall, more packs, chance. Damn, Lacazette too. Yeah, these are okay. Yeah, what I like is uh, I'm going to be grinding though. Like all these, all these players, I'm going to get myself gold upgrade packs as well. Right? Now, the gold upgrade packs, I'm not going to open for this episode. I'm sorry. I'm going to save it for the stream viewers. Uh, so... If you like me grinding the, the rich man account and you want more than what I give you on YouTube, then I stream 8 to 10 hours a day. You know, Nick2018 on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Nick2018. The link is like one of the first links even in the description. If you guys want to hang out, that's the place to do it. And we're going to be jumping back on the poor man RTG today as well. Uh, later on in the day to continue the grind, man. Bronze packs are so nuts that I'm going to sit there with my chat and force them to watch me open bronze packs. Yeah, wait for lightning. As I said, Grumpy, the challenge is I'm going to spend my FIFA points on these packs here. If I finish these FIFA points and we get an inform walkout, I will add another 12,000 FIFA points for the lightning round that's coming out in 19 minutes. If I finish these FIFA points and get nothing, then EA can fuck off. And I'm not going to give them more FIFA points today. $260 uh, on 24,000 people points for this episode is more than enough, man. If I can't get a fucking inform walkout in $260, Amen. then they can piss off. Uh, offer, offered Tiger, thank you for the prime, man. Burns, thank you for the prime. God bless. You're part of the $100 giveaway so far. Oh, whoops. I put that guy in the wrong spot. I'm not saving the non rares, duplicates at least. Gotcha, my bad. Yeah, I know. I overcomplicate things, so that's more my bad than anything, my dude. Apologies there. Open the rare mega? Uh, I will. I will open the rare megas. I will open the rare megas as well. Uh, we should have enough points left over, right? There's six left. Hey, Amen. I'll open one of these. Let's see if these are better. Lil Sosa, thank you for the brand new sub. You're part of the $100 subscriber giveaway on Twitch. Ah, where are the walkouts? Come on, EA. Come on, give us an icon. Give us a team of the year. Oh, shit. Okay. Close enough. How much is Sinclair? That's straight up discard, isn't it? Uh, okay, let's do this. Uh, discard, 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 sell later. Uh, sell later. Discard, discard, discard. Boom. That pack, man. Rare mega pack. 1100 That's like $13 per pack. Oi, oi, oi. Oi, oi, oi. Oi, That's no bueno, dudes. Packed anything good today? Nope. Nope. It's looking like two days straight of Team of the Year pack openings uh, of us getting absolutely nothing, man. Absolutely nothing. Uh, Jorginho. How much are you, sir? Wow, 84s are great price, man. You know what? I'd be tempted to pick up 84s. I'd be tempted to pick up 84s, man. Am I here? But all those squad fitnesses. No wonder squad fitnesses are cheap. Are these worth anything? Nope. Sorry, ball. Blah! Blah! Gross! God, why would they put a man you kit in my in my pack, man? Disgusting. My mom needs FIFA points, help. Am I actually not going to get a walkout from this? We're going to end the day on one walkout. It's in company, though. 
I never realized how big Vincent Company's head was until I saw a couple of memes of his head and I was like, whoa, that's intense, man. Discard pack? I'm not doing a discard pack, dude. The whole point is to try and build a team, build a god squad on this account, man. Uh, okay, so keep all of that. And I'm at, you know what? This is kind of nice doing this series for a few days because I don't have to think about anything. You know what I mean? It's just freaking opening packs like a moron. You know, making a little bit of coins here and there, looking at the market, preparing to buy players. So it's nice. I'm not going to lie. It's like taking a little bit of a vacation away from the poor man RTG. And even more importantly, me spending this money and seeing how fucking awful pack weight is, is making me even more excited to get back to the poor man road to glory and get back to grinding on an account where all of us can be happy about not spending any money um, and an account where it, you just benefit from grinding. Because this is so shit, dude. Unless I pack a blue. Nope, still shit. Absolute fucking ripoff, dudes. So bad. Belgian Man City player that wasn't KDB. Dude, sucks, man. Sucks to suck, bros. Sucks to suck. He's a kid with the golden feet. Big Dick Dyer, don't mind if I do. No look pack. Dude, I'm not, I can't do it, man. I can't do it. I want to look. This is the funnest time of year. I could do some, dude, what the? You guys wanted me to open these mega packs, bro. They're so trash. My God. Thank God I didn't go to gold two with these terrible mega. Oh, oh, okay. That's okay. That's not a bad pack, actually. I thought there was an icon sitting there, dudes. Anyone else think that was an icon for half a second? If I'm running a PMRTG, should do we do leak upgrade packs? Yeah, absolutely, bro. Well, if you're running a regular RTG, I still think leak upgrade packs are an efficient. If you want to open packs, like leak upgrade packs are still a fun thing to do. You know? No, no one thought that was an icon. Okay, cool. Just me then, guys. Just me. Just me. Laporte? Get out of here, bro, with these terrible... Te Look at you, dude. That's worth something. I don't know if the center forward to striker is. Nope. And confirm it is not. This G kit might be worth something. Don't care. All right. Why not? You know what? I'm going to go back to these. I'm going to go back to these, man. Feel like I feel like the pack luck could come from these instead. Or, or not. Or not. Amen. It is what it is. Gonzo. Thank you for the prime, brother. Appreciate you, man. God bless. Holy moly, holy moly, holy moly. Sub trust. I'm not doing sub trust, dudes. I don't trust the subs. I don't trust you guys, man. What happened to wait and then do a draft? Now nah, we've given up on it. Dude, I literally just said we're doing the challenge. If I finish these 12,000 FIFA points... Or whatever is left, and we get an inform walkout, I'll add another 12,000. But, Man City, walkout, Aguero. Yo, hey, congratulations. That's still still good good coins. What is he, like 200k, right? Can't believe $120 equals 100,000 coins. That's pathetic return. Yeah, it is. It is, man. It is. All right. Is that another walkout? Wait, no, he's 85 rated, huh? That 85 rate, that's not even a walkout. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god, man. EA, you're too cruel, man. What is this? For these packs. Goodness gracious. Uh, JRA, thank you for the nine months with Prime. It's disgusting how bad these packs are. Hey, you know what, man? I'm not upset about it because I know that these packs are bad, right? What I am happy about, though, and I've said this a few times already today, is that this at least shows my viewer base how fucking terrible spending money on this game is. And hopefully, this EA's terrible pack weight and them giving me nothing from these packs, I hope it at least convinced you not to spend money on this game. Go freaking buy yourself some new shoes. 
go go buy yourself something on Fortnite, where at least and use creator code Nick Twenty Eight T, but where at least you know what you're gonna get. Like this is just a scam. It, it really it really is. This is this is a lottery. This is gambling. This is a casino. This is a slot machine. I highly recommend you guys don't spend your money on this shit, man. And that's why EA hate my guts because I'm gonna be honest with you guys and not fucking sell the fact that you should should open packs now. If you so choose to open packs, obviously go for it. I'm not gonna tell you otherwise. You are the, you know, you're the master of your own life. Go for it. But to all my young viewers out there, man, that are on the fence or not sure, should I spend my Christmas money? Should I spend my hard-earned allowance? You know, maybe you've got like a paper route and you wanna spend a little bit of money on something, you know, that isn't a necessity, like a little bit of your disposable income, even if you're a kid or you're a teenager, spend it on something else, man. Dear God, save it, save up, buy yourself something fun, get yourself a new kit from your favorite team, you know? Treat yourself to go to a game, take your brother to a football game, your sister to a football game, I, I don't know, man. So much more you could do than spend it on this trash. Or at the very least, wait until Saturday. Wait until Saturday when the full, uh, the full team of the year is at least in packs. If you are gonna be uh, a crazy big money spender, then just wait. Wait, what happened here? Confused. Oh, well, whatever. Hey, Batch. Uh, contrast with 500 bits donated there. Thank you, man. Packs are no longer available. All right, 3,300 FIFA points left, which insanely enough, perfectly works out to me opening these final three rare mega packs. So thank you guys so much for watching the epi today. I appreciate you dudes. God bless you guys. Um, in terms of tomorrow's episode, I think tomorrow's episode will have defenders. So I think we'll do the same thing. As of right now, I owe you guys a hundred dollar giveaway. It'll be for one subscriber for the video. Again, just like the video, something about Debrina being sexier than Nick or whatever in the comment section to be part of the giveaway. Um, it's unfortunate. Tomorrow we'll go again. We'll load up another 24,000 FIFA points and I'll do that challenge again. If I get a walkout in form tomorrow, at least. By the end of the 24,000 people points, maybe we'll add another 12,000 people points uh, for the next lightning round. But for today, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna call it there, man. Like, I, I don't feel like we owe EA any more money. We'll slowly but surely work towards this dream team. Let me give you guys a quick idea of where player prices are at right now on day two of team of the year. So as of right now, um, Leo Messi is obviously, and Ronaldo and Mbappe have gone up in price, right? The cheapest they were at, as I mentioned earlier, was 4.9 buy now for Leo Messi. And Cristiano Ronaldo was about 7.8, 7.9. One went on bid for 7.7. .7, but 7.8, uh, 7.9 for Cristiano. And then Mbappe, I believe, was like 3.7, right? Something like that, cheapest. And he hasn't gone up that much, per se. Um, now, in terms of the midfielder, so Luka Modric, dear God. There's a lot of him on the market. I wonder where a 99 Modric will settle. Maybe like 5 mil? <sighs> That is a card and a half, man. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What a card. Okay, so Modric is 6.5 right now. What are we looking at for Kante? Oh, you love to see it. So already Kante is about the same price of the Viera that I wanted to get. So that's great. I was planning on getting this 88 Viera and they're about the exact same price. So I'm going to get Kante for sure for this account. Absolutely going to get Kante. And then let's. this card's got to be like 5 mil. You know what? Is he about four? 4.2 right now. So on the poor man road to glory, I am so happy that I did the 93 Futmus De Bruyne for 500k. The Futmus card is an end game meta card. I can only imagine how incredible this card is, but even on that account, dude, people were saying I was an idiot for spending 500k on that card on a first owner road to glory. And I'm glad I did it. I'm so happy I spent the money, especially seeing the price of his team of the year card, man. It's not like we're going to pack him on the road to glory, right? So on the poor man road to glory, at least. Maybe on this account, we can be a little bit better. All right. So for next episode, another 24,000 FIFA points. We'll be ready to roll. Uh, we're going to grind all week long, even on this account, to get as many of these player packs as possible for one final pack opening when all the players are in packs. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you dudes, man. God bless. And uh, hopefully you are enjoying the content. If you're missing the poor man road to glory, we're a couple of days away from the poor man road to glory. Um... Oh no, please don't be an inform. Oh! Oh my god, it was it. GG? Okay.
Dude, I thought I would have to add another 12,000 FIFA points, man, which would mean this video would be another 15, 20 minutes long. Oh, let's go. Last pack is going to be a team of the year. Well, walkout right there gave me a freaking heart attack. Yeah, dude, imagine last pack is a team of the year. So this goes from a $100 giveaway to a $500 giveaway. Oh, Mama Sita. Okay. Uh, Gigi, I'm going to sell. 88 rated has got to be what? Now, like 29K, something like that. 29.5. Hey, closer and closer to the end goal, dudes. All that matters. That, 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 that. Come on, man. Prove me wrong, yay. Give me a big, big pull. Even give me an informed walkout so we can add more FIFA points. Prove me wrong about these packs being trash. Prove me wrong, please. Please, man. Oh, that's unlucky. Look at look at this, by the way. Look at this. League SBCs are good. See? See what 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 old Nick2018 would have said, oh my god, you missed Team of the Year Messi by an hour. No. No, not accurate. Not accurate. Oh my god. See, this is I want to see this once, dudes. I want to see this one time. One time I want to see this walkout. Please. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll sell that later. Boom, boom. All right. Stay focused, dudes. Two packs. Two packs. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're going to get a blue. We're going to get an icon. I have a fanculo. No walkout, dudes. Puta. Puta EA. Good. Oh, my God. What an awful pack. Holy sh... All right. Well... Up comes the final pack of the Epi. I can get through this damn shit. Oh my god, this is so annoying. Ooh, draft token. Yo, I forgot to do the draft today, dudes. All right, tomorrow's Epi will grind the draft, okay? To try and get one of the Team of the Year cards. Yeah, I totally forgot about I got so caught up in opening packs and talking shit today that I we didn't do a single draft for this episode. All right, whatever. Final pack. God bless you all. Thank you for watching. Oh, oh. Blue. Oh, no. Is he going to be an Infor? No. Oh, my God. The final pack. Hugo Lloris. Ew, I packed this card 7 billion times, man. Oh, God. If that was an Infor, I would have owed you guys 12,000 more FIFA points. Not only that, another 50 bucks. So... We end the episode on a $100 PayPal giveaway for today for this video. God bless you guys. And we'll catch you on the flip side next episode to do this all over again with the Team of the Year Defenders. Peace, bros.